I've got the tracking on just for all the mineralization changes but it's still running nice and quiet I'm happy with it all right since the signals are kind of few and far between I brought some coins and we're gonna do some fresh burials um, I'm gonna dig you know some deep holes and see how the eraser reads it so what I brought today is a US quarter clad Okay, I've got a clad quarter and since Dominique has that uh, her thing has a uh, I'm going to borrow her pinpointer because we have inches on it. So eight inches, it's way down there. So I'm at like up to here. That's probably nine up to the orange. So we'll say this is more than nine, nine and a half. Let's put a nine and a half inch quarter down there. That's verified off this pinpointer. This is going to be tough. I hit this thing at eight or nine before, but this is this is way down there now. Let's see if our machines can ID this. And we are in wetter, blacker sand. So this is going to be a tough one. This is going to be a challenge for any machine because it's mineralized sand. Dominique's a ninja today. <laughs> a tiger ninja or a leopard? A what? Are you a leopard or a tiger? Leopard. <laughs> to the left of my coil, we have a nine and a half inch U.S. quarter. Verified with Dominique's pinpointer. I got the gain at 90, uh, disc at 40, tracking on. Now to the left of the coil, we have the quarter buried. Let's see if we can get it. Nice. Look at the look at the ID. It's ID and right at that depth. 94.95. Yeah, that's sick. And you verified that with your. Yep. Heck yeah! Awesome! That's nice right there. If this thing can ID a depth and stick at 94 like that. 98, it's actually upsizing it now. I'm slightly off the ground, half an inch and it's still 87. Off the ground, it's fallen a little bit, but still a high conductive target. That's impressive. I think I could get that at 10 inches. Let's take, just for giggles, take the tracking off and see if that makes a difference. So, tracking off, I'm going to rebalance. Okay. A ground phase of 20 now and look at that now the pie charts uh, filling in as I touch the ground so that just shows you how mineralized this is I'm picking up a nine and a half inch clad quarter with mineralization that high that's impressive now let's see if we get a better signal or whatever with tracking off about the same 90 94, 95, so about the same. Tracking on other machines, I hear, cuts into depth. On this one, I think I would keep tracking on on the beach or a mineralized um, area like red clay. Sorry I'm sniffling, my nose is running. There's probably a ton of wind noise, but this is a cool test for everybody to see.
Okay, so I actually dug up the quarter at that depth. You saw me verify it with the pin pointer. It's out of the ground right there. And watch this. I guess the ID on a US quarter is an 89. So it actually up averaged and usually it, it drops down. Usually you get a lower number. So up averaging is actually a kind of a good thing. It's a, it's, we'll say 90. We'll say 89.90 is the reading on a U.S. quarter, and it actually up averaged it a few digits to uh, from a depth of uh, what was that? Nine and a half inches, did we say? Cool. All right. Well, we're rolling. I just want to show you that today I'm using the neoprene. Uh, this protector on the bottom, which is a good idea, especially on the beach, so they don't want to get sand all up in that speaker. So that's a nice touch that the Pro Pack comes with that. All right, guys, we're heading back to the car. It is cold and windy. We had an awesome second beach hunt today. It was so fun here in Narragansett. It's a beautiful little town. I might actually just say, screw it, I'm moving here. Except, <laughs> except they have a lot of snow here, too. Yeah, but look at the beautiful historic casino behind us. That's, yeah, that's this... gorgeous. And, um, you know, we found a few things today and um, we tested our salt modes and we had fun because there's too much snow to do anything else. That's right. We had a lot of fun. I just, I found all those shells and all that sea glass too. No, it's not forget about that kind of treasure hunting, right? No, it's good. So we will see you next time, guys. Please like and subscribe. Uh, Silver Slingers and Bill at Dick Fellas. Thanks a lot. Bye, guys. Later, we're out of here.